got some bad news. My smart mirror is sick. I built this about five years ago and it's been going strong. When it tries to turn on, uh, it gives this message that says, kernel panic, not syncing, virtual file system, unable to mount file system on unknown block. Unsurprisingly, this took place during a power outage. When it came back on, the smart mirror did not work. So yeah, it looks like the SD card's corrupted. Step one will be removing the mirror off the wall, plugging in a keyboard and mouse, and trying to get into recovery mode. Okay, so I've plugged in a keyboard and mouse, and in theory there is a recovery mode we can go into just by hitting shift on boot. Putting shift here. Okay, let's try that again. No. Okay, I don't think the recovery mode's gonna work. Yeah, maybe the corruption's just uh, upstream of even getting to recovery mode. Um, so I'm gonna pop this SD card out put it into my laptop and see if I can find the corruption there. Okay, so first aid complete. I literally have no idea if that did anything. Nope. Maybe recovery mode works now. Uh, before I pop that out though, I want to look at how to do FSCK. Is that file system check? Repair file, file system check. Okay. No! I've got a crazy idea. I have a new Raspberry Pi with a functional boot drive and I might try just copy pasting into my corrupted boot partition. Let us see. <sighs> okay, so I've tried a lot of stuff to bring this back to life today. I wiped the card after cloning it, reinstalled it on a freshly partitioned SD card, I copied the boot directory from a functioning Raspberry Pi image, I ran file system repair tools uh, using the disk from Mac and using the FSCK command line tool, uh, and nothing worked. So what I've got now is a new image from a different project. If this turns on, the solution is just gonna be uh, build up my Raspberry Pi image from scratch again. Uh, because I can SSH to this as well, I'm gonna hang it back up on the wall. And the really good thing about smart mirrors is when they stop working, they just become regular mirrors. Install magic mirror on Raspberry Pi. I'm gonna leave this to install, following the steps on Magic Mirror. I really do wanna turn it on and off with my voice. So I'm gonna go back to work for me in 2017. I do already have my own Alexa skill, running and publishing to SQS, and reading Q from target systems. This is what I am after. Just to recap, in 2017, I wrote an Alexa skill that based off specific voice commands publishes a message to a queue. And on the Raspberry Pi, I've got a service that's subscribed to this queue. How exactly I run this, I can't remember, but the gist is I know I need this access key and access secret from my Amazon SQS. So I'm gonna jump in there while Magic Mirror installs. Okay, so here's my URL. I don't want y'all seeing this. Okay, so I'm gonna go fishing around in SQS. I'm gonna find this stuff. I'm not gonna show it on video. So NPM has installed Magic Mirror and I retrieved my credentials uh, to set up my Alexa script again. So now I'm installing some dependencies there. Now if we start it, it should load up on the screen. Looks like SSH might not work and I need to run this. 
Indeed, it seems to have simply made the screen black. I can't see anything here. I am gonna go to VNC Viewer. I've got a server running as part of my base image there as well. So let's download VNC. Oh, okay. Yeah, the screen's there, cool. Looks good. It's upside down. We'll fix that. Let's see how to spin that monitor. Config, zero normal, one's 90. Display rotate. Two. Dump it at the bottom. So now if we reboot, it should rotate the physical display so it's not upside down anymore, but don't really care about that at the moment. Let's see if my Python script is runnable. It's checking the script now. I am gonna go see if it will actually turn on. Echo, ask Magic Mirror off. Turning off. Hmm, it doesn't seem to have turned anything off. Ah, uh, the script called TV off is not found, but it did receive the message. Okay, so now I need to make the script called TV off. Oh, TV on and off found here. Let's drop them in place. That's good. Now let's try to be off. Ah. Looking over my shoulder, I can see that that worked. TV on. That worked, great. Okay, so the TV scripts work. Because control power runs constantly, I'm now gonna add that to the cron job exactly like this. Hook me up with Emacs, yo. Now when we turn on the Raspberry Pi. This script should start automatically so we can control it by voice regardless of whether Magic Mirror is running. Now we just need to get Magic Mirror configured and set up to auto start. So auto starting Magic Mirror. Yeah. Okay. That should do it. So let us reboot. Oh, hell yeah. Sweet. Echo, ask Magic Mirror off. Turning off. Boom. Echo, ask Magic Mirror on. Turning on. Sweet. Okay. As you can see, the Magic Mirror is much healthier once again. And all I had to do was reinstall everything from scratch. I uh, got my calendars back, got our weather back, added a third party module for the first time, which is a poem of the day. And now that it's all running, I just need to go back up that SD card. So uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching me try to debug this. I hope you go back up your SD cards because it's really handy to have an image. I wonder if there's a German word for people who don't back up their Raspberry Pi SD cards. Speaking of German, Got a German poem here. Fragment er det kun list som vis glides ved. Er det kun list som vis glides ved. Vor arm er davor jord pa saliged. Johannes Ewald. I'm not sure if that's German, but I think it was.